The nursing vacancy in Mississippi continues to skyrocket. Reports indicate thousands of positions are currently open and it's impacting health care in the state. WRG's Bria Jones joins us live now with the very latest on this ongoing situation. Bria? Well, staff, it appears that this problem is only increasing for hospitals across Mississippi, in some cases leading to major cutbacks. A hospital crisis is looming in Mississippi as the state sees its highest vacancy rate for nurses in a decade. Officials believe the labor shortage coupled with stress during the pandemic is a major factor. Another issue, reports show amid the shortage that hundreds of potential students are being turned away. One student sharing her personal experience. One of the factors being that there's a lack of faculty, education space and resources needed to create new nurses. Over 1,000 applications are sent to nursing programs each year, but many are declined due to the lack of faculty. Data from the Mississippi Hospital Association shows vacancy rates for 2022 range from 14% to almost 29% for Mississippi counties in the Mid-South and over 3,000 vacant nursing positions statewide, an impact being felt way beyond the region. For hospitals that are short nurses, they've had to close down whole floors. Um, they've had to end service lines. We're hearing about labor and delivery units closing all over the state. So what can be done to turn things around? The director of the Center of Quality and Workforce at the Mississippi Hospital Foundation says recruitment will be key. We need more faculty. We need more uh, scholarship funding for our students. We need uh, more nurses that come out in the workplace and have an RN come to the hospitals and work. Now we have reached out to officials to find out how this is impacting local hospitals. We're expecting to get those numbers tomorrow. For now reporting live in DeSoto County, Bria Jones, WREG News Channel 3.